who's this girl? Uh, Meghan Markle. Oh, seemed like a nice. <laughs> Where are we gonna go? Lady? Just complaining. I was like, didn't she hit the light skin lottery? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Now, uh, can you let me know in the chat in your niece and nephews? Is that the actual thing, what he's just saying? I do know myself in some Asian cultures, especially in like Bollywood, for example, the more fairer skin you are, the more likely you are to succeed and stuff in them cultures. But to say, actually come out and say it on a Netflix show, whoa, man. Hit the fucking light skin lottery and still going off complaining. Acting all dumb like she don't know nothing. Going on Oprah, I didn't know. I had no idea how racist they were. It's the royal family. You didn't Google these motherfuckers? I love that. Such obvious point. Google. If she didn't know about the royal family, Google them. Anyway, if you don't know about something, the first thing you do is get your tippy tappy out and Google it like. He's got a point there. <laughs> what the fuck is she talking about? She didn't know. The fuck is the royal family? They're the original racists. They invented Ooh, wow, he's going on here, isn't he? Like... Colonialism. They're the OGs of racism. They're the Sugar Hill Gang of racism. <laughs> Like the hip hop, the hip it, the hip it, the hip, the hip hip hop, and you don't stop of racism. Oh, I've not heard that hip hip hippy poverty for many years. Like that is old school. The fuck is she talking about? I didn't know. I love that great observation and a great like absolute statement of truth. Like you, if you're gonna marry the Budweiser, you're literally gonna know like they're gonna be like an alcohol totally. They're so racist, they're so racist. Some of that shit she went through was not racism. It was just some in-law shit. Now, I'm sure all my niece and nephews, we've all been there, meeting the in-laws. It doesn't matter where you're from, don't matter where you're from, it don't matter, it's not a good time. Sometimes it's just some in-law shit. Because she's complaining, I'm like, what the fuck is she talking about? No, Oprah, they're so racist. They wanted to know how brown the baby was going to be. They're so racist. They wanted to know how brown the baby's going to be. I'm like, that's not racist. Because it... I would say one thing, though. If I had a mate like, you know, who had ginger hair, like, and he was dating his missus, I actually would say, you, 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 I would say to him, like, is your kid going to have ginger hair, like, you know? You know, he's going to be a ginger, a ginger winger. Then again, Megan is married to a ginger winger already, so... Even black people want to know... How brown the baby gonna be? Shit! We check behind... Now, niece and nephews in the chat, please let me know. Is that an actual thing where people of a diverse ethnicity actually want to know how um, dark skin your baby's going to be? I'm quite curious. I think I'm, I'm quite curious to see how true that is like. I'm ears! a scientific test because <laughs> you got to see what kind of black child you going to get is this a step different different what what this is this, this, this different kinds this is what curry baby <laughs> or a draymond green baby i have no idea who them people i just mentioned so if you're in the chat you could let me know it'd be fantastic Thank you, my niece and nephews in advance. I'm assuming basically what he's trying to get across here is basically there's different kind, of, like I said, like in Bollywood, for example, that if you've got a fairer skin, you're more likely to get the better acting jobs and be more successful. And in some Oriental countries, well, the more fairer skin you have, the more desirable that people in them countries think you are. It's quite incredible that what well, see we're accusing not the royal family being racist but in countries all across asia for example they just they, they prejudice and discriminate their own people from their tone of their skin it is quite a very weird world we live in sometimes it really is like i know what she going through i know what megan mark was going through i know, I know her dilemma black girl trying to be accepted by her white in-laws oh it's hard Black girl trying to be accepted by her white in-laws, it's so hard. It's very hard. But it ain't 
is hard as a white girl trying to be accepted by her black in laws. <laughs> In all fairness, I actually have seen a clip on the Fresh Prince Bel Air where literally I think Janice brings home a white boyfriend and the reaction is like, what the carnations? So it does actually work both ways on this one, which I suppose most people wouldn't think of that off the, top, off the bat, you know what I mean? Like, now that shit is really hard. Shit, you bring a white girl home for Thanksgiving, <laughs> your mama gonna say something. Thank you for watching my niece and nephews. Please like and subscribe me out. I'll see you in the next one.